also have T.R. Prasad Gowda from the JDS. In midst of all of this, Mr. Gowda, it seems uh, that the JDS is looking at actually forming an alliance with AIMIM. How much truth is there? As a matter of fact, uh, we are very keen on forming government on our own, uh, on our own uh, you know, uh, capacity. And we are working for that also day and night. Our, Kumar, our uh, former Prime, uh, Chief Minister Kumar Swamiji is a, is floated Pancharatna Yojana and uh, uh, and uh, as a manifesto and it travelled across across the state of Karnataka more than 10,000 kilometers and uh, uh, visited almost all constituencies uh, and uh, uh, for one round he has finished all the, 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 and uh, he wa we wanted our party to be on the on our capacity to form the government. On Are our you forming? Is there an alliance in order where AI MIM is concerned? See, priority priority only uh, only. We, I, I told you as earlier. I told you uh, we wanted to form the government on our. Sir, own in order to form the government which you want to form, is there going to be a pre-poll alliance with AI MIM? No alliance with uh, anybody. No alliance with anybody. And, uh, uh, and we w we will fight we will fight on our own and we are uh, capable and we will go into form our own government sure sir without okay anybody all yeah. right okay lavanya balal coming back to the ticket distribution which you were talking about the fact is there is no urgency for the bjp to actually announce their ticket they can get exact cash calculations right if they wait for you to announce it. It's not that you've had a safe passage. You've had massive revolt, rebellion after your own announcement of 163 tickets. See, uh, there will be a little bit of uh, uh, disagreement and disgruntlement in any party when, they elect, when, the, when the tickets are announced because there are multiple aspirants for every seat. But the logic of BJP is waiting to get its caste equation right. Uh, uh, to get his cast equation right, it's waiting for Congress to finish uh, distributing the tickets is ridiculous because the party should know which cast equation will work in Karnataka, in which constituency. So the BJP claiming that they are waiting for the Congress to announce their tickets is ridiculous. Everybody knows. For example, if a constituency has maximum number of Lingayats and a very uh, uh, small number of genes, obviously the ticket will go to the winnable candidate or the candidate who has a maximum number of voter support. Why do they need to wait for Congress? Why can't they do things on their own? Don't they have a survey report? Their survey report... No, but they're not say saying that. that. Nobody, no, 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 no. Nobody is saying that. They're just saying that they're taking their sweet time. What's the, you know, what's the point in all of this? But Mr. No, Mishwa, they're, yes, yeah, they're not taking their sweet time. They are not prepared for the elections. It is as simple as that. If they were prepared for the elections, look at BJP's performance the, Mr. Vishwa, you know, the, Congress, the, the Congress has not only announced their 163 tickets, they've also uh, projected a figure on our you know, show itself. D.K. Sivakumar says it's going to be 141 for the Congress. Yes. It's a challenge yes. to the BJP. <laughs> See, yes. Preeti, um, just now the Congress spokesperson was mentioning about cash combination and she said about Lingayat. I'll ask her one thing. Out of 28 candidates, you know, the number of candidates which has declared in Bangalore till now, there is not even a single seat to Lingayats. There is not even a single seat to Lingayats in Bangalore. Does it mean that there are no Lingayats in Bangalore? This is ridiculous. They should know the facts and then Sir, they should speak. Sir, I was just giving an example. I can finish, Madam. Let me finish. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let, me let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Okay? So that's not easy as the Congress. As I told you, you know, the Congress is overconfident, you know. They will be in the sky always. Let them be in the sky. Not an issue. And DK Shukumar says, you know, last time also they were like this only. Finally, you know how much they got. They got 79 seats and we got 104. The same thing, you know, this time also we are going to get more than 140. I'm telling you today, take it from me. Well, interesting. We are you are getting 140. The, the Congress is getting 140. And as per the JDS, no, the JDS is forming government on its own.